Hello, kindergarten friends. Today I have my son here that's going to help me read our super smart story. The title of our book is called Play Ball by Judy Woodburn. Remember, Sal likes his sports. So this book is going to give us some information all about different types of balls that you might use when you play a game. Are you ready, Hayden? Yeah. Okay. Can you look at the cover of the book and tell me what you see? Uh, I see people, kids doing uh, a game with the ball that they're holding. You're right. When you're going out to play, bring a ball or lots of balls. And what kind of ball are they playing with, Haven? They're playing with a beach ball. There are many different kinds of balls. Each one is right for a different game. How are these balls different from one another? These balls are different uh, by the different shapes and sizes. You're right. Are any of them heavier than the other? Uh, I think the bowling ball is heavier because you have to use it to knock down pin pins, and the pins are heavy. You're right. You can hit a baseball. A baseball is a small and hard, and you, you hit it with a bat. If you hit a baseball far enough, you can get a home run. Let's watch this girl hit the ball. Wow, did you think that was a home run? Uh, yeah. You can kick a soccer ball. A soccer ball is made of different color, colored patches. Soccer is a game you play using your feet. Kicking the ball into the net it scores a goal. Let's check out this girl as she kicks the ball, soccer ball. Have you ever kicked a goal before? Yes. How many have you done? Uh, I don't know, but I got, I've got a lot. Awesome. You can bounce a ball in tracks. The small red rubber balls are often used in this game. You bounce the ball quickly, pick up some jacks, then catch the ball before it bounces again. Let's watch these girls play this game. She did it. Did you see how many she picked up? Uh, I think she did one. Have you played with jacks before? Yes. You can swat a tether ball. A tether ball is tied or tethered to a pole. You try to hit the ball so it swings past the other player. Where have you played tether ball before? Uh, I played tether ball at uh, my school. And when you hit the ball, how do you hit it? You uh, have to hit it with your hand and with your palm, but you can't pick it up. All right, let's watch them. <gasps> Ooh, he had a nice hard swing, didn't he? Yes. You can shoot a basketball. A basketball is orange and bumpy. It's easy it to hold and bounce. It, in basketball, you score points by throwing the ball through the hoop. She made a basket. What do you know about basketball, Haven? I know that you try to steal the ball from the other team and get more points than the other team. You're right. You can roll a bowling ball. Bowling balls are heavy and have three holes for your fingers. You roll a ball, the ball, down the long lane toward 10 pins, white pins. The more pins you knock down, the more points you get. Why do you want to knock down a lot of pins, Haven? You want to knock down the pins so you can get more points. Have you ever played, or have you ever went bowling before? Yes. What is that called when you knock all the pins down? It is called a strike. Now it's your turn. See how many points you can knock down with the bowling ball. What do you think? How many do you think you're going to get down? Uh, I think I'm going to get strike or seven down. Here we go. How many did you knock down? Ten. Nice work. Strike.
You can toss a bounce. Bocce. Bocce ball. Bocce balls are heavy like bowling balls. Only smaller in bounce. Bocce, you, your team tries to toss its balls closest to the target. The target get ball is small and white. Can you find it in the grass? Can you see it? Yes. There it is. Oop, he got really close to that target ball. He's going to be the winner. You can swing at a tennis ball. Tennis balls are yellow and fuzzy. Players use rackets to hit the ball back and forth to each other over a net. Nice swing. Can you pretend to swing, Haven? There you go. You can tap a croquet ball. A croquet. A croquet ball. Croquet balls are br brightly colored balls made of wood or plastic. A croquet, you use a mall mallet. mallet to tap the ball through metal loops that are stuck in the grass. Have you ever played cro croquet? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe that's something that you can play, something new. Wow, he did a nice job getting that ball through those um, little pins. Let's play. Use the mallet to tap the croquet ball through the last three loops. If you hit the stripe pole, you win. Here we go. Let's see if we can do it. So close. Try again. One more time. Do you think we're going to do it? Yay. It's running a little bit slow. You can hop on a ball. Hoppy balls are big and squishy. Hold one to handle and off you go. Why do you need to hold on to the handle? Haven? You need to hold on to the handle so you don't fall off. You're right. Have you been on a hoppy ball before? Yes. Okay. You can flick a marble. Marbles are small, pretty balls made of glass. To play marbles, you use a marble to knock other players' marbles out of the circle. Watch the boys use the marbles. Can you flick it? You use your thumb and your finger and you flick it. Tap this marble to see what what happens. Oh, we got two. If you knock a marble out of the circle, it's yours. Two points. You can pass a football. A football is brown and oval. It, if you pass the ball to the teammate and he carries it over the goal line, your team scores a touchdown. How is a football different from the other balls we've been talking about, Haven? A football is different because it is shaped different like an oval. Nice. Whoa, he threw it right over her head. She didn't catch it. That she'll try again. Balls aren't just for kids either. Everybody can have fun with a ball. Why do you think the author wants the grown-up in the picture playing football? I think the author wants the grown-up in the picture because he says that uh, uh, grown-ups can play with uh, balls too. Yeah, they can have fun just like you have fun. The end. 
All right, Haven. Nice job reading. So what was this whole book about? Play sports. Uh, the book was about uh, different types of games that you can play uh, using balls like marbles, footballs, and others. Yes. Is there something new you learned about playing with balls? I learned that uh, there's a game called marbles, and you have to uh, use a marble to hit other marbles out. Yeah, that was something new I learned too. All right, boys and girls, I hope you learned something new about balls and how you can use them when you play a game. Thank you.